Well, you've asked for it, and here it is. A new series, now that the Romans are uh, behind us. Maybe they'll return one day, who knows? But it's time for something a little bit fresh. Uh, this is going to be the first non-human playthrough that we're going to be doing. Welcome to the Cuddle Muffins. Now, the Cuddle Muffins are by far the cutest species in space, except for the small fact that they are A, post-apocalyptic, B, fanatic purifiers, they hate other Xenos, and on top of that, they're all militarists. What a delight. They are survivors, which means that they have Tomb World habitability, and then uh, they're non-adaptive, habitability minus 10, doesn't really matter. Intelligence, which makes them great at science, thrifty for that energy bonus, fleeting, because uh, they don't live very long, it offsets with the survivor bonus, and strong for mining. Not that we really need that, maybe we'll do something about that later in the game. I don't feel we necessarily need it as we may go robots. Uh, this will be a heavily modded playthrough as well. I've got all the bells and whistles enabled, I also have Gully's um, planet modifiers on. So, let's dive in, let's set up our galaxy. Uh, a medium galaxy, spiral, uh, let's, let's give it a decent amount. Advanced AI starts is off. Marauder Empires 2. Uh, let's set this to 1.0 as it should be. Habitable Worlds uh, 1.25. Uh, primitive Civilization Crisis Strength. Let's increase that this to 2.0. Good. Uh, let's put it on Scaling Difficulty. Uh, okay, Hyperlane Density 1.0. Abandoned Gateways times 2. And Wormhole Pair times 2 as well. Well, let's dive in with the Cuddle Muffins, shall we? Let's see how long we live. I'm really curious about how this is going to go. Ah, yes. The eon since the first primitive Cuddle Muffins uh, basically uh, took a, their feet onto the planet. They found it. Uh, Gully's Planet Modifiers. Pick the number of modifiers you to spawn on random planets. It only affects planets generated at the start of the game. Modifiers will spawn after you unpause, and this may take a few seconds. I want the normal amount of modifiers, please. Surface of bones. Skulls, bones, corpses. As far as the eye can see, the entire surface of this world is covered in bones. A horrific sight. Whatever battle may have happened here, it must have been brutal. And also recent mass extinction, which is going to give us a bonus to that. Okay, cool. Well, that's that sounds very delightful. Bomb crater, bomb crater. Well then, All right, let's get a monument up and running. Uh, funnily enough, food-wise, we're pretty stable right off the bat. Uh, let's get some labs, uh, a heritage site, and an engineering building, and we'll take it from there and see what we can do. Uh, let's also take a look at our solar system. Yes, I am running with the advanced camera, and this does make the game look uh, significantly prettier. Also, uh, I think it's beautiful universe that we're running, so that is nice. So that's the thing. Uh, there's a bunch of minerals that we can take here. So let's go and build a mining station over here, and the science ship uh, is basically ready to go. And yes, the camera can move in every single direction. We need to set up shop here and here in order to uh, gain control. And yes, real space is also a thing as we are running with uh, real space, which means that uh, all of our solar systems are, can be really friggin' weird as well. Uh, let's go and head down the pipe. Let's see if we can find something of interest. Um, by the way, considering we are fanatic purifiers, we don't need to learn how to terraform. Armageddon bombardment will do that for us. What a delight. Cool. Alright, let's take a look here what we can get. Uh, I want to get another science ship as soon as we can. Uh, obviously, we're getting some mining up and running right now. In the meantime, let's take a look at what we have here. Well, as is tradition, you Zeno scum. we're going to need to turn that off. Xenophobe. Under no circumstances must the Xeno be trusted. It will lie, it will cheat, and it will do anything in its power to undermine the efforts of those who, in truth, are its superiors. Indeed. Xenophile, oh, even though we're so cute, though. Look at that. Uh, species Kelzen. I, I don't know why I uh, just named it Kelzen. It seemed to be prudent at the time. Uh, so that's the thing. All right, cool. So we got this solar system here. There seems to be, like, a weird dust cloud in here. Not entirely sure what's up with that. Cool. Uh, also, uh, sh fleet's s uh, scaling is different in this particular playthrough. So, uh, the spaceships are all a lot smaller, so they look a little bit better 
in the context of the game. And yes, we are playing with pink humanoid ships, because why wouldn't we play with pink humanoid ships? Okay, so we're about to get that online. We're going to have a food problem here soon. Um, Construction complete. Mining station is done. We should be able to get another science ship soon, and there it is. And then we'll sh we should have enough energy to get another uh, science complete. leader as well. Happy tree. Uh, ooh, sensors, sensors indicate the presence of a small artificial object. Yeah, so uh, let's not do that. That is the teapot. Um, <laughs> there's actually a relatively small chance for that to spawn, but apparently it did. What's going on over here? Okay, so that's some some energy and minerals. Construction complete. Okay, cool. Let's go and get some new leaders in here as soon as we have the enough energy for it. Overall, I I wish I could cycle leaders. That would make life a lot easier, but sadly this is not the world that we live in. System survey complete. Oh. We have this we have recovered artifacts from an ancient alien civilization on Amatizer 5. Incredibly, the civilization, which apparently referred to itself as the Cybrex, seems to have been made up of machines that were linked together in some sort of collective consciousness. Uh, the age of artifacts indicate that they were active some 600,000 years ago. Situation log updated. Jesus Christ, this, this voice set is awful. Um, this channel is now under military control. The laws of nothing. What is this? No, 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 it'll be fine. Yeah, here we go, that's... Survey the stars. For millennia, we have looked at the stars and trying to understand them, but they were always beyond our reach. Now we finally have the technology to do so. Some of our sci years, best scientists are uh, ready for an expedition. Let's do it. Situation log updated. Ah, I like this voice set. It's very, it's very uh, on the nose, so to speak. Uh, let's uh, get an outpost going over here. Ooh, a continental planet. It's only size 15, though, and it's also not a tomb world. I love the fact that we have sur a service of bones. Can provide habitats as bonuses. Plasmoid life. It's made a substantial discovery. Somehow life compromised entirely of plasma has managed to evolve around this star. Unfortunately, the ship can, cannot venture closer for a better scan. As the sun thermals radiation is proving too much for the ship. Cool. So... we. Oh, right, so we need to study these here stars in order to uh, do something productive with it. Let's get this outpost going. There's a lot of minerals here, so we want to get those under control. Let's track all this shenanigans on the map. Like, the camera, the updated camera is pretty cool, don't get me wrong, but, uh, my god. It does sometimes do some weird snapping. Situation log updated. All right, cool. Let's get an engineer. Let's get a new scientician in here. Do I have a scientist? Uh, you're surveying. You're wow. Look at that. Two geniuses in a field, dude. Uh, what's good? Yeah, let's just do it like this. Uh, bu 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 bum. We'll move you down. Can I just do the research project here? Yeah. Okay. So what we'll do is we'll just. Go over here, survey this system, do the research projects there as well, and then move around these systems and see what we can find. Obviously, the more we can find, the better. Let's uh, do a quick control click here so that we can. Construction project concluded. <laughs> I like this voice back. It uh, sounds like a dick. That's great. Good. Uh, let's get some food up and running because that's going to be a problem in the midst of short term. An ancient space station of some kind has been located at the edge of the Turban system. The strong residual substase signature uh, that surrounds the station indicates that it may be a gateway. We have discovered a gateway right at the core of our empire. How curious. Let's take a look at this system. See if there's any... Yeah, you've got three minerals. Yeah, we can... You can build that up. That's some good, some good policy. Getting those ongoing. Yeah, Gulliman's, uh, Gulli's Gulliman. I want to say Gulliman. I don't know why. Precursor remnants. With new art, the science expedition uh, has found uh, some uh, ancient remnants. Cool. 
Special project concluded. Okay, so, okay. Uh, this is a valuable world. There's a significant amount of infrastructure left on this concluded. planet. Uh, small cargo pod, yeah. Let's quickly read this. A valuable world. This world is, did not appear to be fascinating at first, but recent discovery have proven otherwise. It is in our best interest to, to develop this world. Uh, streamer, this is... Um, Oh, okay, is this... We need terrestrial sculpting. We can actually terraform this. That's cool. To ban five. And it has a bunch of cool resources on it. It's a bunch of tech bonuses. Cool. Uh, so, well, we're, we are not in a position to do any sort of System thing. Survey concluded. Uh, let's get down to business. Let's go for the discovery tree. Just for those initial bonuses. Sky Cities in the sky. Interesting. Ulium. Dense jungle. Wet climates. Cities in the sky. The landscape is dotted with remnants of an unknown civilization. Bright metal spi uh, spires and monoliths reach up beyond the cloud cover. The towers are shaped to concentrate sunlight on certain areas and provide excellent living conditions. All right, that sounds delightful. Not that I am going to do anything with that, but construction project concluded. Sure. Okay. Uh, I bumped into the cargo pod. Oh, well, that's... At least in uh, 2.1, we can no longer fail these sort of missions anymore. So that's cool. Can we just uh, set you to do the research projects in the system first, please? Because that saves us some time. Uh, I thought we were tracking all on map. Yeah, I was about to say. Okay, so we're tracking everything on the map right now. That's good. Natural wormhole. We have detected what appears to be a naturally occurring subspace phenomenon on the edge of the Ascension's end system. Cool. So, whoa! What is that? A large B main times uh, main sequence star. Okay. That is very cool. And that is, of course, a black hole. And we will be doing the research project for it. And there we have uh, another... We have a, a wormhole. Relatively close to the uh, edge of our empire, uh, core to our empire as well. So that's very exciting stuff. I like how this planet generates unity for some reason. Uh, that's pretty cool. System survey concluded. Uh, did you? Can we just do the research projects over here? Yeah, let's do that first. Take it from there. Let's see what we can find. Ah, uh, yes, yeah, the Happy Tree. That's our our capital system, of course. Our our capital planet. At happy light, because we are happy. We are happy. Research concluded. Uh, research speeds. The star is a sad reminder that all the things in the universe are finite. No, oh, that's oh particles. Nice. Uh, ship designs are fine. We have some upgrades that we can do uh, specifically here, but we don't want to do that just yet. Uh, Food-wise, we are okay. We can just move one of our pops over to deal with that, so that's not the end of the world. Construction project concluded. Good. Our empire grows. And that also... Can I... Can I yeah, thank you. And there's uh, three minerals on this, on this planet that we want. High density of minerals is always good to get. It's a protostar in here. Uh, this looks like a supernova. Maybe. Could be. System survey concluded. Okay, so what do we got here? Okay, M star. And we're doing the A star as Construction well. Construction project concluded. Just getting these out of the way. Uh, this is the M star. Oh, the A star is on Special the other side. Project concluded. Oh, an energy bonus. A uh, very bright star will probably burn out in a few million years, which is pretty standard. 
during the examination, notice that onboard solar collectors generate 150% uh, of energy. We don't get any cool bonuses out of this, though. Let's get some energy instead of the science. Okay, do we have any cool bonuses we can get in here? I don't. Oh, there's five. Is, are these four minerals all attached to one planet? No, they are not. That is a shame. Okay, so what are our options here? These. Way hey, another binary system. Ogi Campus. That's four energy in one system, so that's pretty useful, I would say. Let's get an outpost going over there. And we're now at minus food. And uh, we should do something about our fleet as well. Let's get one more Corvette up and running. Because pirates will come. And we don't like pirates. Special project concluded. Cool. This time is old and fusion processes have just started to shut down. Hey, we got fusion power. Cool. Star studies. Cool. Well, we got a bunch of tech for it. And our scientists have quote unquote leveled. Construction project concluded. That is a big star. Class M. Yeah, the, because of the way real space works, the systems are a lot larger, which makes t traversing back and Evading forth hostiles. A, taking a lot longer. We've got some Xenos. What do we got? Enigmatic spacefarers. What is this? Oh, Void Clouds. Okay, that's a shame. I hoped that they would be uh, Flagella, because then I could use uh, Flagella ships, or even something along the lines of... Um, maybe, if I can get like the, the, the drones, then I can get the lasers. The lasers are pretty good as well. Like, they can... They can fight ships up to tier 3 lasers, which is surprisingly good. Good. Uh, to boldly go, survey speeds. Speed is increased. Let's do that. That's something that we want. Okay, so energy is starting to become a minor problem. We can Research fix that. Concluded. Energy up and running. Ah, yes. Minerals plus 5%. Anomaly found. Let's just research this. It's only 5% failure risk, so... Wouldn't be the end of the world. Uh, it's Construction another... project concluded. Cool. And we have more ships for our fleet. Construction project concluded. Can we get some more ships, maybe? Colors of another world. Continued observation of the photosphere uh, of the ISS Gala Hunter reveals uh, multiple micro-wormholes linked to a different dimension. The constant spontaneous formation and collapse inside the star is just depositing large quantities of exotic particles within it, accounting for unusual spectral readings. Cool. So that's more resources then that we can use. We got a lot of resources right now anyway, so um, I do want to... How do I not have a shipyard? Oh, because I'm an idiot and I paved over the shipyard. Anomaly <laughs> found. 5% It's nothing. We can easily do that. Okay, we don't have the resources to build anything in here at the moment, so that is a bit of a shame, but that's how it is. Uh, we can try to take control of the gateway system. Aerostat colonies, that's fine. It gives, uh, it gives us standard plus bunch of resources. Well, considering the amount of energy that we system have is more than included. enough. Uh, unusual readings. This world may not be where it is according to long-range scans. Construction yes. Project concluded. I'm also running the more events mod, by the way. So some of the events may not be standard. So just so you're aware. Construction project concluded. Excellent. So we have a little bit of additional tech. We're getting ahead in the physics department, which for now is okay. Time displaced planet. This world emits strange chronoton readings. Somehow this world has been displaced out of time. It's not known when this world was born or when it's from, but it sure offers a lot of opportunities. Wow! What? Holy shit. This system Evading is. Hostiles. 
that, that system is crazy. That's 11, <laughs> 11 physics in that one system. Whoa, okay, we got a Nova. Anomaly found. 30%, I do like it. Yeah, that's a Nova system. That looks very, very cool. I'm not gonna lie. Okay, so this is up and running. We're gonna go and expand over here because that planet, we are gonna science the hell out, the shit out of it. And it also looks like we're about to look at this proto star over here. Traffic in operation. After exploration, exploring the complex extensively, our science ship made an amazing discovery. The data cores appears to be mostly wiped or eroded, but we've established that the complex below to a civilization unfamiliar to us, which went by the name Karkorians. Apparently, they operated thousands of years ago and this sector of the galaxy. Something else, however, seems to be more unusual. The lower level is densely packed with a large number of stasis pods containing bodies of our own species. Many of them are still wearing advanced shackles or have crude implants in their nervous systems. It would appear that these Xenos have abducted some of our primitive ancestors and subjected, subjected to the experiments before, uh, before, for reasons unknown. They chose to kill them by cutting the power supply to the stasis pod, leaving the prisons to suffocate. We've detected elevated radiation levels from the walls and equipment from inside the complex, and the power core seems to have been either sabotaged or suffered a leak in the past, but we cannot be sure. The residual data extracted. What happened here? Oh, it's an event chain! Oh, that is- oh, that is so cool. More events, mod. Yeah, that's the one. Underwater facility, the hub memorial, and the rendezvous. System survey concluded. Oh, this is very cool. This is actually really exciting. I haven't- I actually haven't done this sort of thing in a while. Not since the game came out, anyway. Okay, so we have- System survey concluded. An ancient precursor civilization. Like, we've got all these missions. we got all this stuff going on. Research Let's get another concluded. scientist. Scientist? Yes. What have we got? Research C plus 5. Cool. Uh, energy buildings. It's Agent Cybrex base. Good. And in the meantime, we still haven't actually made any first contact yet, which I found fascinating. Uh, okay, cool. So, first things first. You, over there. Where is this hilarious planet? There you are. So, tempor temporary displaced planet. And it's also a valuable world. Barren and rocky. Uh, we, we can also terraform it. If you want to. So that is really, really badass. Not gonna lie. Right, we got a new sign ship. And archaeologists as well. Uh, archaeologists are kind of like a the odd one out when it comes to... Some of these missions, the memorial. What's this? Okay. Shall we do the memorial? Okay, you need to be a higher level, apparently. Bruh, okay, get good. Get good, scrub. Yeah, this is great. I I actually have a smile on my face right now. Uh, assisting ancient precursors, yes. Uh, science division, uh, we kind of want to get the polytechnic education because of the 25% leader game, which is pretty good. Okay, food is going down now as well. That's good. Ancient precursor stuff. Let's take the opportunity to build some more ships just in case. System survey concluded. Okay, organic remains. Interesting. Uh, at the same time, the cybernetic machine consciousness ravaged this part of the galaxy. Yeah. Research concluded. Uh, impressive structures practically concluded. begging for archaeological work. Heritage sites. There is planetary unification. Planet monthly unity plus two is amazing, uh, especially at that state. This stage of the game. Uh, let's get. The jester is that the trickster is actually really good because of the way real space makes the system so much bigger. So that is very useful. Uh, we could try to expand our territory a little bit more. Uh, Edic the monolithic. That's just a bunch of uh, engineering research. Ocean world. Oh man, so many system cool things. 
Fuck it, we're gonna get another another science ship. We're gonna get one more. I wanna I wanna I wanna find more stuff. More events mod, baby. Open research concluded. This project opens the options menu. Anomaly found. Uh, a mountain of information. Anomaly found. Simulated projections. Okay. Uh, robots. Yes, always. Good. You don't have anything to do right now. We're gonna put you on there. So, let's go down the pipe here. Let's see if we can find anything cool nearby. Where are you? You're a, you're a third uh, level three scientist. Cool. Then you're going to be doing all these awesome research projects that we have sitting around. This is great. I love it. Um, Resource-wise, we're pretty System survey looking pretty good. Swirling Shadows is pretty standard. Shadow play, plus six. Society research. So. Construction project concluded. Okay, so, you. Let's build a research station here. Getting two Unity a month is always useful. Besides, in a gate system, a gate system is always useful as well. Uh, currently cannot afford another Corvette. And with that bombshell, we're going to go and wrap this up. Welcome! This is the Cuddle Muffins, uh, whose love and unity is only being surpassed by their ability to uh, get their point across by using uh, nuclear fire. But thank you so much for watching, and uh, I hope that you're going to enjoy this series. It's going to most likely be a relatively long one. Uh, nobody will want to talk to us, because we are Fnatic Purifiers. We're on it. Uh, we're going to be alone in this universe. So if you like this, feel free to give it a like and or subscribe. And uh, until next time, take good care of yourselves and, as always, each other.